All right. Hi, everyone. My name is Dave Ahrens. I'm the co-founder and CEO of Unbundled Attorney. And we're glad you made it because today we get to pass along a skill set to you that has completely transformed the practice of hundreds of lawyers around the country. And that skill set is the ability to effectively and efficiently field internet-generated leads and deliver unbundled legal services to your clients. And once you develop these skill sets, you may never have to worry about paying the bills or how to generate new clients in your practice ever again. Now, the reason we decided to hold this webinar is because we are in the process of building a network of attorneys that have the skills and knowledge to be able to serve as many clients as possible. And we believe offering unbundled legal services is a critical part of accomplishing this goal. Now, it is important at the outset to understand that you do not need to work with us in order to benefit from this webinar. You can take the tools, the strategies, and the best practice we're going to be sharing with you and apply them immediately in your practice and be able to start seeing a lot more clients retaining your services as a result. Because whether you work with us or not, we're committed to making a significant impact on the amount of people that are afforded to work with attorneys in North America. And so if you can take these ideas and help more people as a result, then we believe it's well worth the time and effort to share this information with you. So whether you are an attorney that's just starting out and looking to get more of your practice off the ground, or you've been practicing for years and want to find more creative ways to attract clients and differentiate your practice from the competition, or maybe you're working for a law firm, you want to generate more clients for the firm, or maybe you've even been thinking about starting your own practice. Today, you're going to be gaining a lot more skills and strategies and ideas that can really make a significant impact on your results right away. So today, what we're going to teach you is how to use internet leads to build a consistent stream of new business in a way that allows you to streamline your practice, leverage your time, and deliver services to a ton more clients. In fact, once a system's in place, you will effectively become the hunted instead of the hunter, and your customers will come to you. And so we're excited to show you how to do that, and you're going to be able to learn this skill set even if you have no marketing or sales experience or if you don't have any technical knowledge whatsoever. We're going to show you how to generate new business, even if you're already so busy, you don't have time to blog, network, or promote your services at all. And we're going to show you how to start receiving leads immediately without a sign-up fee or any kind of long-term commitment or contract. Now, before we jump into the material, I do want to clarify that you don't have to take our word for the results we're going to share with you or the effectiveness of these strategies. We produce a bi-weekly podcast called the Unbundled Attorney Mastermind, where we interview our provider attorneys and they openly share how they've integrated these strategies into their practice and the impact it's had on the growth of their firms as a result. So for example, we recently had an attorney on the show from Denver, Colorado by the name of Matthew Beach that has generated over $250,000 in revenue in a single year from our leads alone by using a unique and well-refined sales strategy and by leveraging the use of contract lawyers. We have another attorney out of Los Angeles, California by the name of Artie Pirnia who literally went from starting a brand new practice to generating tens of thousands in revenue per month in less than six months. And he you know, walks through that transition period and how he made that happen. And then we have another attorney, for example, in Orlando, Florida, that shares her holistic approach to the practice of law and how she has been able to serve her clients with a compassionate and also affordable service while doing extremely well financially at the same time. And after this webinar is over, we'll send you an email with a link to our podcast so you can listen to these episodes and hear directly from our provider attorneys about the exact strategies they've implemented to produce such exceptional results. So basically, what we're sharing with you here is a recipe. And if you follow this recipe and include all the necessary ingredients in the right order, there's a very good chance you're going to get the exact same results. So let's start with our primary goal for you today which is to prove to you beyond a shadow of a doubt that everyone watching this webinar will learn to do three things. Number one, you're going to learn the proven best strategies for how to properly contact, consult, and convert internet-generated leads into paying clients. Second of all, you're going to learn how to effectively offer unbundled legal services as well as a number of other creative options that will help you retain more clients than you ever could before. And then third, you're going to learn how to leverage and automate many aspects of your business using technology to streamline your practice, which is going to help you lower your costs, increase your profit margins, and really give you that competitive edge that you need to thrive in today's modern and crowded marketplace. And why is this all important? Well, if you can learn how to do this, and acquire this skill set, it really can potentially change your life forever. And what I mean by change your life is that you'll never have to worry about how to attract new clients to your practice ever again. 
When you have the ability to generate a consistent stream of new leads and sell your services to willing clients in need, you have the ability to make money on demand. And we have worked with attorneys that are brand new starting out all the way to attorneys that have been practicing for over 50 years. Uh, in fact, recently in, in the exact same week, we started working with an attorney that passed the bar two months before and an attorney that had been licensed for over 53 years in the same week. And both have been experiencing great results. In fact, one of these attorneys, Zoe Garvin, was on a recent episode of our podcast. Uh, where she shared how she was able to generate over $10,000 in revenue in her first two weeks and how she was able to sign up over a third of these new clients right over the phone without meeting them in person while working from home. So these are definitely some pretty life-changing results. Oh, and by the way, if you haven't done so already, uh, you want to make sure you have a pen and paper handy to take some notes because you're definitely going to want to. Uh, now, with that being said, I have a few quick house rules before we dive into the content. So first... If you are a law firm that requires an upfront retainer of three to five thousand dollars, and you are not open to adjusting this pricing in order to serve clients in a more affordable manner, then I can tell you right now that we will not be a good fit to work together, and this probably won't be a useful webinar for you. You know, one of the things that makes our network and our community unique is that every one of our attorneys offers unbundled legal services in addition to full representation. And that is the expectation and the commitment that we make to the leads that we attract. And we believe very strongly that by connecting these folks with compassionate attorneys that are willing to offer these types of options, we stand to help a lot more people gain access to legal assistance they need. And if you aren't willing to offer these options, we really thank you for your interest, but I can tell you this just isn't going to be for you. Secondly, we've already shared some pretty incredible success stories from a few lawyers we've worked with. And while these results are 100% real and authentic, I think it should be fairly obvious, but I'll say it anyway, these results are certainly not guaranteed. You know, our most successful lawyers are highly skilled and highly motivated to get the results they achieved. And it took us some time and some effort in order to master this process. And while we can give you a massive shortcut by walking you through these best practices, you will ultimately have to put in the required time and work in order to see the results. And the ones who do get the reward. But I can tell you, some of you watching this presentation right now may not take immediate action. And given our limitations of availability in each market, we may not have leads available by the time you do so. And I will talk about that a little bit later in the webinar. But if what we share with you today resonates with you, I'm just going to encourage you to take action right away. All right. So if you're still with me, the house rules are over. Let's just dive right in and get to work. So what I'm going to show you is how to build a thriving practice using internet leads and unbundled legal services and essentially create a turnkey system that allows you to consistently retain new paying clients on demand, which can free up your time to focus on serving your clients and growing your practice. So let's start by defining what this system needs to look like and what it will look like. First characteristic is it's consistent. And that means it generates quality leads for your firm at a steady and reliable pace. And you can even ramp up the volume gradually over time if you wish. Second of all, the system is practical, which means it will give you the step-by-step -step process to take a client that is a complete stranger someone that's never heard of you, and teach you the necessary steps to follow that will help you maximize the amount of clients that are going to retain your services. Uh, third of all, it is innovative in the sense that it's going to teach you how to creatively offer pricing options that the majority of leads can comfortably afford, you know, even if they're of limited means, and also has strategies built in that ensure that you will be paid very well for your time in doing so. And finally, it's duplicatable. So if you wish, you can eventually hire and train staff or associate attorneys to work the system for you and provide services to the clients, which can free up your time to grow your practice further or give you time to spend more time with your family or, you know, do the things that you love. You know, and that's really the key. You know, once you've learned this system and the skills that are necessary to make it work, it continues to work day after day, month after month, you know, year after year, uh, regardless of the ups and downs of the economy. You know, it's why many of our provider attorneys no longer do any marketing at all for their own firm. Let, let's just get right into it. Here's step one of our formula. Uh, the reason so many of our attorneys consistently convert so many of our leads into paying clients is for two reasons. Number one, they understand how to effectively contact, consult, and then convert internet-generated leads into paying clients. You see, internet leads are not the same as referrals from other attorneys or people calling your firm because they heard about you through one of their friends or family. 
By the way, they're also not the same as someone who found you online, you know, read your articles or your social media posts and got to know your brand and they elected to call you. Internet leads usually never have heard of you or your firm before, which means they are not sold yet on hiring your services. So this means that the process you must follow in order to contact, consult, and convert that lead is very different. And in just a minute, we are going to walk you through the exact steps you need to follow to be effective at converting leads into paying clients. However, before I can explain that process to you, you need to understand the second reason why our attorneys convert their leads into paying clients so consistently. Because even if you follow the exact steps to contact and consult your leads, you may still get some good results, but there's still going to be a fraction of what's truly possible. So the second and most important reason is that our attorneys learn how to effectively deliver unbundled legal services. Now, now what does unbundled legal services mean? It means that our attorneys are willing to limit the scope of their involvement in a case down to specific tasks, you know, handling parts of the case, and then the client handles parts on their own to save money. And we're going to talk exactly about the types of options they offer in just a minute. But essentially, they're not requiring the clients to pay them five grand up front, you know, put simply. So they're working with the client on a pay-as-you-go, oftentimes a flat rate basis by the task, which is also known as discrete task representation. Or they simply offer a lower starting fee and then craft a payment plan with the client that fits their budget. And regardless of the options our providers use, and again, we're going to talk about each option in more detail so you can start to think about which options, you know, if any, you're going to be willing to offer to your clients. The most important characteristic of all these unbundled legal services is that the typical cost is going to lie somewhere between $500 to $1,500. Now, there are some exceptions to this, as you're still going to have many clients that can afford to pay you a higher upfront retainer, you know, two, dollars $3,000, either because they can afford it themselves or they have the financial help from their family. However, it's offering all these other unbundled pay-as-you-go, flat rates, and payment plan options, that's the critical difference between having one out of 10 leads retain you and one out of two. And that difference in conversion rate can mean thousands uh, and even tens of thousands of dollars in additional revenue every month. So now before we get into the details of the types of options our attorneys offer their clients, it's really important to understand the bigger picture of our current marketplace and why it is so critical to be flexible and innovative with the way you work with your clients. So here's a graph that shows the amount of pro se filings from 1971, then again in 1992, and again in 2004. Now, as you can see back in 71, only about 1% of filings were self-represented litigants. So since then, we have just been seeing a tremendous increase over time. And today we're seeing about two thirds of filings in family court now being self-represented parties. This graph shows uh, California, but these are pretty much the numbers all across the United States. And these numbers can even be higher in many large cities. So what does this mean? Well, this means that there are literally about half as many clients that are hiring attorneys to represent them as 20 years ago, and about a third as many as 40 years ago. And this is mainly because most people nowadays just can't afford to shell out three to $5,000 upfront to retain a lawyer. And if that is the only option that you offer your clients, you know, the, the pond that you're fishing in is now half or a third of the size of what it used to be. And then you combine that trend with this one. This is a graph of the number of attorneys that graduated from law school each year over the past 50 years. And we've gone from 10,000 new lawyers in 1963 to over 45,000 new lawyers in 2013 alone. So we've literally seen a 400% increase in, you know, the past half century. You know, and you might say, well, you know, there's been a lot of population growth in that time. That's true. So you know, let's let's compare that. So in 1963 we had 189 million people living in the United States and that year there were about 294,000 active attorneys. In 2013, we then grew to 315 million people, and we had over 1.2 million active attorneys at that time. So we have essentially gone from one lawyer out of every 642 people back in 1963 to now one out of every 249. So there are now about three times as many lawyers per person in the United States as there were 40 years ago. Now, not only has the pond you were fishing in become half the size, there are now about three times as many fishermen. You know, talk about a lot of competition for not a lot of supply. And that's not the only factor as well. There's one more. 
In the past 10 years, we've also seen the emergence of internet-based legal tech companies like LegalZoom, Rocket Lawyer, and many others. And these companies have developed these web-based you know, online software programs that provide these intuitive and well-designed you know, do-it-yourself DIY legal document form services at these you know, really low fixed fees. You know, and as many of you have seen, you know, many of these companies offer you know, these online divorces for $300, $200, or you know, in certain cases, you're even less. And, you know, when these companies first came out, these are merely programs that would just spit out the forms to the clients and they'd be on their own to file it themselves. But, you know, now these services include legal advice and docking review from, you know, licensed attorneys in their state. And it's still all for one super low flat rate. So now the pond is half the size and there are three times as many fishermen and there are a ton of big corporate boats advertising prices that are about a tenth of what everyone else is charging. So as you can see here, this is not a very pretty picture and certainly not the picture you had in mind when you enrolled in law school. And I'm sure in many of your cases, you know, understandably took on tens or sometimes even thousands of dollars in student loan debt in order to get licensed to practice in this modern day market. So the question is, what do you do? Well, the answer is, or at least our answer here is, you fish in another pond. You fish in the big pond, you know, the pond that has the 67% of the fish and hardly any other boats. So let's talk about the keys to success because by other hardly any other boats, very few lawyers that are gearing their practice towards serving the 67% of folks that right now are going unrepresented in the, in the family courts and many other courts across the country. So let's talk about the keys to success to reaching this market. And first, it's imperative that we find a way to offer options that can fit into the budget of the average North American working family. So let's get right into the types of unbundled and lower cost options our attorneys offer and some example price points of each level of service. As I mentioned before, typically unbundled legal services will cost somewhere between $500 to $1,500 because you know clients, if they're paying anything higher than that, at least up front, then they're usually going to be retaining for full representation. And what we can talk about some you know creative options you can offer clients for full representation in just a minute. But within the unbundled legal services, first you have like a combination of document review and then providing advice and guidance. And that's usually around the $500 range, somewhere in there. Then you have level two, which is document preparation combined with the same advice and guidance. Um, that's usually around the 750 range, give or take. And then you have level three, which is commonly known as limited scope representation, which basically includes docking preparation, giving them advice and guidance from option two. But now you're taking the next step and filing the paperwork on behalf of the client and then entering a limited appearance. Each of these rates are established based on an hourly rate of two to $300 per hour. However, there is a way to deliver these services and still make an effective rate of even higher than that you know, three to $500 per hour and sometimes even more. And I'm going to share that strategy with you in just a moment as well. But for now, let's just assume you're going to be charging two, three dollars an hour. And let's take a look at these options. So for $500 or so, our attorneys will spend typically two to three hours with the client, giving direct coaching and advice on exactly what the client needs to do to proceed with their case in the short term. So often this may involve, uh, if, if a client already has the forms prepared, reviewing them, or if not, uh, directing them to the appropriate forms online that they'll need to prepare and file. And then once the client completes those forms, reviewing them for accuracy and then giving them some guidance on the proper filing procedure and you know time factors and anything else they need to be aware of once they file. Now, it's really important to note here that all of these options we're going to talk about here are typically pay as you go, which means that you know, the client can elect to buy more time if additional services are needed at any time. And that's actually quite common. Uh, once people realize how complicated family law issues can be, and you know, also they've had an opportunity to get comfortable working with you, they'll often find a way to come up with the additional financial resources, either themselves or through the help of friends or family. In fact, we found on average that about a third of the clients that initially retain our attorneys on an unbundled basis ultimately will elect to transition to full representation later on in the case. Uh, and that awfully means uh, paying an additional two to $3,000 retainer after the initial unbundled legal services were rendered. So that is the first option, docking review with the coaching advice and guidance. The next level of, of unbundled legal services, the docking preparation services combined again with you know, advice and coaching. 
And this is by far the most common form of unbundled service. This is where you prepare the client's case documents, draft the written arguments for them, you know, the petition, the response, whatever it is they're needing help with, and do all that for them rather than just reviewing and correcting what the client puts together on their own. And this is a great option for clients that, you know, because they can petition or respond without having to t- come up with a ton of money up front. And this is especially useful if they have, have to respond within a short period of time and have limited resources to do so. And, you know, oftentimes, even when they do file the paperwork, it's going to go to mediation anyway, you know, which you can kind of give them advice and guidance about. And they may be able to come up with an agreement with the other party in mediation. It's a great option for them, but it's also a great option for you because once the task is completed, unless they want to retain you for additional service, you're complete with that client. And so for many lawyers that don't want to get into a, involved into a lot of long, drawn-out court battles and a lot of litigation, this can be a really great way to deliver services to the client, You know, pick up $750, and then be done with the case. It's something that a lot of our attorneys really appreciate is that they can you know, deliver the service and then move on to the next thing. All right, so then the final option, third option, uh, is commonly co- re- referred to as limited scope or limited assistance representation. Typically involves advising the client, preparing the documentation, and then again, taking that next step to file the prepared documents on behalf of the client and enter a limited appearance. Now, there are many states throughout the country that fully approve of attorneys entering a limited appearance. And in some states, there's even a form called the Notice of Limited Appearance that's filed along with the paperwork that informs the court that you're going to be appearing just for that hearing. However, there are still some states that have not fully approved limited appearances. Uh, In fact, there's a number of states where judges frown on such actions and could potentially require you to continue representing the client beyond the agreed upon hearing. So therefore, it's really important that you check with your local and state ethics opinions and get more familiar with your local courts and judges if you haven't already already to find out if offering limited appearances is an option that you can realistically offer to your clients. All right, so that gives you a brief overview of some of the unbundled options you can start offering. And as I mentioned earlier, each of these options can be billed by the hour, hour by hour. However, there is also a way that you could potentially get paid a higher effective hourly rate. And the way you can accomplish this is by leveraging the time of either a paralegal or by utilizing a document automation technology to streamline the preparation of the paperwork and then billing the client for these services at a flat rate. See, because clients are are really grateful to be able to get assistance from an attorney that can help them with their case for, you know, $500 to $1,000 because most firms will not provide any services unless they're able to pay them three to 5,000 bucks up front. So this is, you know, a great value to the client and they are more than happy to be able to work with an attorney at that rate. So now let's say you charge $750 for level two unbundled services where you're going to advise and guide the client, you know, prepare their case, deliver the documents with instructions on filing and the next steps from there. So then the question then becomes, if your normal hourly rate, say 250 per hour, does it have to take you three hours to get this done? What some attorneys will do is they will charge the $750 as a flat rate to perform these services and then leverage the use of their paralegal or document preparation software or both to cut down the amount of time they have to actively spend on the case themselves. So let's say your paralegal can prepare all the documents for you and can accomplish this in two hours at a rate of $50 an hour, which obviously is a very generous hourly rate and certainly on the very high end on the amount of time that they would usually spend on preparing these kinds of documents. And then you spend an hour or so on the front end advising and collecting the facts from the client and then about another hour or so on the back end reviewing the documents once they're completed and then walking the client through how to file the paperwork of the courts and advising of some of the next steps. So you collected $750 and after you pay your paralegal the $100 for the preparation work, you have $650 left. And if you got it done within two hours of your time, your effective hourly rate on that unbundled work was $375 an hour. Now you combine this with a cloud-based practice management software like Clio. And using this kind of platform, you can upload all the court forms for the region you service on a regular basis once. You know, so whatever the forms are that you use in your local courts, you upload them into Clio and 
then what you do is you have your team enter in each cl client's case information during the intake process. Or even better yet, there's systems where you can actually have an electronic intake form that the client can complete themselves and also submit you know, their story or a questionnaire or you know, basically a synopsis of their case that your paralegal can then use to start drafting the, you know, the written argument, the factual declaration. And then once all that is input into the system and a record is created for that matter, that case information can then be automatically populated into whatever forms need to be filed for that case with a couple clicks. So depending on whether you have a paralegal or staff or if you're solo, this type of technology can really start to speed up these types of repetitive processes and just kind of automate that and have it happen a lot faster and a lot more efficiently. So now if we go back to that original example, well, you should take your paralegal two hours to complete. Now only takes one. So $50 instead of 100. And what used to take you maybe an hour on the front end, let's just say it only takes you 45 minutes now, which would be conservative. You can kind of work that down to 30 minutes even. And then only 45 minutes on the back end to review the completed documents because you know now you have everything in one place, accessible online within your you know law practice management software. And then we do the same math and all of a sudden, you know, you, you pay your paralegal fifty dollars, that's seven hundred dollars. Now it only takes you an hour and a half. And so now your effective hourly rate becomes, you know, four hundred and fifty dollars an hour or more. Now, of course, these numbers will vary based on the complexity of each case and what needs to be done. But as you can see here, there's a lot of ways you can start thinking about how you can start to deliver these solutions to clients and still get paid very well for your time. You know, this is the fallacy that so many firms believe that somehow if you're working with lower income families that you have to make lower income. And I can tell you that we have hundreds of successful lawyers that have proven that this is assumption is completely false. And not only can you provide services to lower middle income families in a way they can afford, you can do so in a method that allows you to do very well financially at the same time. Now, these unbundled options are great, but what happens when you have a client that needs full representation because the case clearly needs to be litigated, but they have limited resources? You know, most attorneys require a very large retainer up front, typically you know, three to $5,000, as we said before, in order to take on a contested family law issue. And of course, this is understandable because when you sign on as that attorney of record, I mean, you are in for the full ride. And so whether you're looking at taking on a case that requires 20 hours or more, you don't want to end up in a position where the client runs out of funds and then you're stuck representing a client without getting paid for your time. So the question is, what if there was a more creative way to structure the retainer, a way where the clients could afford to start the case? So you're not turning them away because you're quoting three to five thousand dollars up front. So you're structuring a, a, a more affordable starting fee. And at the same time, you don't have to be as concerned about your clients making timely payments. If that was the case, you would probably be able to bring on a lot more clients if you were able to be confident that you'd be able to pay your fees because you could take a lower retainer and more people could afford that, but you need to be confident that they can pay it. All right, so here's what many of our attorneys are doing. Let's just take a hypothetical example. Let's say they know it's a, it, you know, it's a family law case that's going to cost about $3,000 to complete, and it's going to last roughly you know three to six months. What many of our attorneys are doing is they will take, instead of three to $5,000 up front, they'll take a retainer of maybe 1000 to 1500 And this typically covers all the initial filings to get started. You know, and some of our lawyers will even take a smaller retainer up front, say, you know, $500, and then have the client make payments, but then they just don't file the case until they've reached that 1000 to $1,500 threshold that covers the initial cost of the filings. Then from there, they work out a payment plan with the client. So the client is paying for the amount of hours that they are putting into that case each month, and they pay it on a weekly or biweekly or sometimes monthly basis. Okay, so let's say you work on their case for two hours a month. Um, the client has a job, and they can afford to pay you know, $250 every two weeks, and they get paid by their job every Friday. So that covers the amount of time you put into that case that month, and so the client doesn't fall behind on their payments. Then what you do is you use a payment processing solution like LawPay. And these platforms, and there's a number of them, have an automated recurring billing system built in that allows you to program the amount of money you would like to bill the client, the frequency of that payment, in other words, how often per month, and the day of the week you'd like to have it drafted. So let's say in this example, every other Friday for $250. 
Now, since many working folks get paid by direct deposit, that deposit lands in their account first thing in the morning on that Friday. And at the same time, automatically payment for your services is being drafted as well. And so by enabling this kind of technology in your practice, our lawyers have found that the payments, you know, not only do they not have to take the time to manually process these payments and keep track of when each payment is due or you know, certainly worse off, call the client and collect the money every time a payment's due. So the payment happens automatically on the days that have been set forth in their payment plan. But they've also found that these payments are being processed successfully much more consistently because of the timing in which they're being paid. Literally, the deposit goes in, their payment goes out like right at the same time. And furthermore, when you can put together a payment plan where the client is paying for the amount of time you're putting into the case each month, they're not falling behind on paying for the time you're investing in their case. You may be thinking, okay, you know, that sounds great, but what happens if clients start missing a payment? And you're right. You know, the system isn't perfect. There's always going to be a few clients that fall behind on their, on their bill, as we all know. By offering a starting retainer, that more clients can afford, which means you're turning away less business, and a payment plan that your clients can comfortably fit into their budget, you're going to be able to fish in the big pond and capture a ton of clients that other firms just wouldn't serve and are basically turning away. And then when you combine that with leveraging software that allows you to have payments automatically drafted at the time they're most likely to process successfully, the amount of additional upfront and monthly cash flow you're going to be capturing will usually more than offset the occasional client that doesn't pay their bill. And once this webinar is complete, we will send you an email with a link to a recent webinar we held with LaPay, which can give you a demonstration of this uh, automated billing feature in action. All right, so now once these ideas are properly implemented, they can really start to make a significant difference in your ability to differentiate your firm and to serve the vast majority of clients that are seeking legal assistance in your area. Except there's one more component. If you remember from earlier, we had said there were two main reasons why our attorneys are able to consistently convert their leads into paying clients. The second reason, which we needed to cover first, was they learned how to effectively deliver unbundled legal services and affordable options for full representation. And you should now know, you know, and have a good idea of some of the types of options you can offer. But there was a first reason. And without properly implementing the first reason as well, you're only going to be able to serve a fraction of other clients that you could. So what was that first reason again? Well, you have to understand how to contact, consult, and then convert leads, internet-generated leads, into paying clients. And as we said before, an internet-generated lead is not the same as a you know war market referral from a friend or family member or someone that found your website you know, and, and learned all about you and then and let you to contact you. You know, when a lead is matched with you, this is the first time they have heard of your firm. And quite frankly, other than the credibility of our company and what we shared with them about Amount of Legal Services when they opted in to be contacted by an attorney, you know, they're not sold yet that you are the attorney that's going to be the one to help them accomplish their goals. In other words, they don't trust you yet. Trust is built through the experience of working with your firm or through the experience of a trusted friend or family member that has worked with your firm. And because this is going to be the first time they're being introduced to your firm, you're going to need to build that trust. So what we're going to do right now is share with you the fundamentals of contacting and converting internet leads. So what are the fundamentals of fielding internet-generated leads? There's really only three. First, you must call your leads in real time or as close to real time as possible. Second, you must take the time to listen to the client and build rapport and trust first. And that can be done either in person or over the phone before you charge them to do so. And third, you must offer a low starting price point that makes it very easy for the client to make a decision to get started working with you. All right, so calling leads in real time. What is real time? Actual real time is the moment the client submits their request and the lead is delivered to you. So why is calling leads in real time so important? So here is an industry chart that shows you the relationship between contact ratio of leads over amount of time passed. So as you can see, if you look at the chart here, if you are able to call a lead within that first minute, that first bar on the left-hand side, you're literally almost four times more likely to reach that lead on the phone than if you were to wait more than 24 hours. And after that initial one-minute window, that contact ratio starts to go down pretty significantly. Now, do you have to call every single lead in real time in order to make this work? Of course not. 
You know, people are, are still going to answer the phone minutes or even a, f- a couple hours later, a few hours later. They're just going to answer it less often, and you may need to contact them two or three times in order to reach them. Why is this so important? Well, if you can call them in real time, you know, and that's something that we train our attorneys to have a strategy and a way to go about doing that. And sometimes they may have to leverage their staff in order to do so. And, you know, we can give you the best strategies to do that. Most of our leads are serious about hiring a lawyer immediately to assist them with their case. And if they don't hear from you, they're going to keep looking. And that means if you don't get the lead on the phone soon, there's a good chance that many of them are going to be retaining someone else. So in addition to delivering our leads via email and post it to your, to your account in our web application, we have also built the technology to deliver a real-time in-app notification, which basically displays a badge and plays an audio alert, like a ding in your app when you receive a lead. We do SMS text message notifications as well that are delivered to your mobile device in real time. So both of these notifications occur literally within a fraction of a second from when the client submits the request. And this notification is a really critical component of being able to respond because it gives you the opportunity to call the client back immediately. Now, once you've received the notification, now is the time to respond. So let's walk through the next steps here. The first step is you're going to want to call the phone numbers provided by the lead. And if they don't answer, leave a voice message. Then once you've left the voice messages, you want to immediately send both an email and a text message. And you know we have templates you can use for the email and, and text replies. So you don't have to rewrite the message every single time. Now let's say you've you called them, you emailed them, you texted them all in real time or very short after, and now you have the client on the phone. The next step is to really take the time to listen to their issue and ask questions. I can't stress this enough. The client really needs to feel heard. I mean, number one, if you're the one calling them as an attorney, they're going to be really pleased about that. And if you call them in real time, they're going to be especially surprised by that too. So call them in real time and it's the attorney. That's really going to surprise them and they're going to be very happy. But third of all, if you also then take the time to really listen to their issue, ask questions, and take a genuine interest in what's going on and patiently, that really helps a ton. They need to feel heard. They need to feel cared about. You know, and this may seem obvious, but you know, gosh, you wouldn't believe how many attorneys will just jump on the phone and quote their fees within the first couple minutes, or you know, even worse, just have their secretary call their leads and then simply tell them, you know, they need to pay a consultation fee to talk to the lawyer. Look, there's nothing wrong with charging a fee or a deposit for them to come into the office, but if you want to do that, then you need to be willing to speak with them over the phone first to build that relationship and that trust, like we talked about earlier and also educate them on the value of your services. Because as we said before, they haven't met you yet, and you need to take the time to build that trust and give them that compelling reason to want to work with you specifically. And what, what's the compelling reason? Well, it's the fact that you're willing to take the time to listen to them, respond to them in real time, and that you offer unbundled legal services. All right, so now that you've, you've listened to them, you've asked questions, and you're clear on what they want to accomplish, then you can start to explain to them the next steps they need to take, and how you're going to be able to help them with accomplishing their goals. And then, of course, you want to let them know that you offer and explain to them the difference between full representation and unbundled legal services, and that you offer both options to them and what that means. And there are a number of strategies on the way to specifically go about doing that. But essentially, you just inform them that you offer both options and that you can tailor your services to their financial budget. Then from there, you're going to want to secure them for either an in-person appointment or as some of our attorneys have done, sign them up directly over the phone. If you decide to meet with them in person, there is a specific strategy we can share with you to guarantee that every single lead shows up for their initial consultation, which involves basically securing a deposit over the phone or by sending electronic invoice for that deposit. In the podcast episode we talked about earlier with our Denver provider attorney who generated over $250,000 in revenue from our leads in a single year, he goes into depth on that exact process on how to get that deposit to secure that in-person appointment. If you prefer to sign up a client over the phone, we can also walk you through the next steps on how to do that as well. We recently interviewed one of our Atlanta, Georgia attorneys who shares how about 98% of the leads that retain her sign up directly over the phone without ever meeting her in person. And she walks through the exact steps she follows to achieve that. And in the email after the webinar, we'll send you a link to these podcast episodes so you can listen to them. And if you like, we can speak with you in depth to design a custom strategy that'll work for you in your local market. But essentially, like it says here, as long as your client feels heard, is confident in what you share with them, and knows you offer pricing options that can fit in their budget, they're usually going to take that next step. 
So now you have kind of the nuts and bolts of how to field the leads and offer unbundled legal services, right? So if you feel confident to start implementing these ideas and begin offering unbundled legal services in your practice, then please do. But here are some words of caution. As with most things in life, when it comes to successfully delivering these options, success will be found in the details. You know, just because you know how the game of football is played doesn't mean you can walk on the field and win a Super Bowl. And it's no different here. You know, what we've shared with you today are the core strategies of how to deliver unbundled legal services in your practice and how to convert internet leads into paying clients. This is a process we have developed over the past decade, working with hundreds of lawyers, fielding hundreds of thousands of leads. And further, in order to implement these options and grow your practice, you're going to need a steady and consistent stream of new clients. And learning how to market online and generate new leads from the internet is not a simple process and can certainly take years to master. Okay, so what if we could remove the necessity for you to learn that skill entirely and we're able to begin sending you leads immediately? Well, if you are open to offering unbundled legal services and you're in a position to take on some additional clients right now, then we may be able to start sending you some leads immediately. And I'm going to explain now exactly how that works. You see, as we shared about earlier, we are looking for attorneys that share our vision for providing more affordable and accessible legal services for the majority of working families in the country. And right now we have hundreds of lawyers nationwide that have proven that not only can you help a ton of people, but by getting educated on how to deliver services that can fit in the budget of these folks, you can also stand and do extremely well financially. In fact, here are a couple quick examples of lawyers that have shared their experience of working with us. I've been working with Unbundled Attorney for approximately a year and a half. My experience with Unbundled Attorney is I started uh, as a solo kind of took a risk uh, and and hoped that it would pay off. Um, and after about three or four months, I started getting more leads than I could uh, that I could handle. Um, so I partnered with a buddy of mine from law school. And we've since added another attorney in two new counties. Um, and we've got a legal assistant and we're looking to continue to grow. So it's it's been vital to our firm's growth. We typically bring in about six to ten thousand dollars of new new uh, revenue a month from just from unbundled attorney the other thing to consider is there's kind of a waterfall effect as as the clients that you signed on month one continue to that you continue to represent on month two they're you're in, they're incurring more bills and so it, it's kind of a ripple um, ripple effect that, that allows us to grow in my experience unbundled attorney is much more effective in advertising than any other um, online advertising I've tried. Managing a Google ad campaign could be a full-time job uh, and I'm a practicing attorney so I didn't I didn't have the time and energy to devote to, to getting the return on investment there. Uh, unbundled attorney has really has really helped our firm grow um, dramatically. Working with unbundled attorney it's incredibly easy uh, to integrate their website and their system into your practice uh, so that you can get the most out of your leads. Um, they've got a website that you can go and check and, and see your leads and, and it's got a management system so you can tell who you've who you've contacted and who you need to contact um, and and you can get started really quickly um, and really effectively. This is Robert Manson. I'm located in White Bear Lake, Minnesota. It's a suburb of St. Paul and located very close to Minneapolis, so it is a major metropolitan area. I was approached by Unbundled Attorney at that point, Family Legal Help, about a year and a half ago. They had a very good program. One of the things that I liked was the fact that there was no contract, there was no term, I could quit whenever I wanted to. The per lead payment uh, concerned me at first, but I soon found that my return on investment was extremely high. I would estimate that I've made approximately nine to eleven thousand dollars a month additional revenue from unbundled attorney the leads come in on my emails they are easy to return they're again extremely productive uh, they have added four to six clients a month at least to my clientele and that's just retainer based in addition we have unbundled services as well that we provide so basically it generates two income streams one is the more traditional, and then the other is the unbundled, where people come in and pay as they go. I've tried a lot of different advertising methods over the years, including yellow pages, magazine ads. I even paid money to have some TV advertising done, and nothing has ever been very productive. 
In fact, I had kind of given up on the whole concept of advertising until I was approached again by Family Legal Help, now Unbundled Attorney. I think it was a very wise move for me to make. I would highly recommend the program to any other lawyer out there, and I certainly haven't regretted going with them at all. It's built my business to the point that I now may be needing to add another attorney. So again, uh, it's a wonderful program. The people that run it are very energetic. They're very insightful, very helpful, very responsive. They're just very good people to deal with as well. If you have issues or problems, I found them very responsive. They're available by the phone. And again, they're just very uh, good people. Uh, they've been very enjoyable to work with. And I found the whole thing to be an extremely mutually beneficial program. So I hope that you give them a chance. I certainly don't think you'll regret it at all. And I think you'll be as delighted as I've been. Thank you very much. All right. So that gives you a couple, a bit of an idea of how our attorneys feel about working with us. There's a lot more in-depth examples here on our podcast. Uh, if you'd like to take the next step in working with us, in just a moment, we're going to give you the direct line to one of our dedicated account representatives so we can have a conversation about whether or not we're going to be a good fit to work together. And during this conversation, we can answer any questions you may have about anything we've shared with you on the webinar today. In addition, we're going to ask you some questions. We're going to want to find out about the kind of unbundled options you provided so far, if any. Uh, we're going to ask you about your caseload, what your goals are for going your firm, and then share with you the details about the leads that we have available in your area. And given that we've worked with literally hundreds of attorneys over the years, by the end of this conversation, we're going to have a clear picture about whether or not we're going to be a good fit to work together. And as part of our commitment to creating a long-term, mutually beneficial relationship, we are going to be very honest with you about this. Because here's what you need to understand. From the very beginning, we made a decision that we would only provide exclusive leads to our providers. So what this means is that each lead we deliver to you is not sold or shared with any other firm. And depending on the lead volume that's available in each region, we typically only need a smaller handful of lawyers to ensure that every client that requests help gets connected to an attorney that is available to assist them and that every lawyer we work with is getting the amount of clients that they can effectively service. We are not looking for a lot of attorneys. We're looking for the right attorneys. And once we have enough attorneys in a specific region to provide services to all the leads that we are generating, we will no longer have leads available in that region any longer. We are being 100% honest and transparent when we say that this is a time-sensitive offer. We're not telling you this to create false urgency or as some sort of a sales tactic. This is the truth. This is how it works. There are a ton of cities across the United States where we do not have leads available anymore. I'll give you a few examples. If you are an attorney that practices family law anywhere in the state of Minnesota, we no longer have leads available. If you are a family law or immigration attorney in Los Angeles County, I'm sorry, but we don't have any leads there either. So if you're a family or estate planning attorney in Phoenix, Arizona, again, we don't have any openings, okay? And I could go on. So the point is, we have a small core group of attorneys that are committed to providing affordable legal services to their clients. And as any of these providers, attorneys will attest, once we find the right attorney to serve the clients in a specific region and they continue to provide the clients with quality and affordable service, we are loyal to that provider. This means that we will not bring on another attorney and then you know cut their volume of the, the original attorney unless the original provider tells us that they can no longer handle the amount of leads that we are sending them. You know, we've had a number of attorneys come on board in the early stages of their careers that have gone on to hire support staff and paralegals and associate attorneys, and they rely on the volume of leads to remain consistent in order to continue to support the infrastructure they have built, and we take that responsibility very seriously. Since you are watching this webinar, there is a very good chance that we still have leads available in your area. However, I can also tell you that you're probably not the only attorney in your region that is watching this webinar right now. If we are seeking a new provider in a specific region, we'll typically run ads, send emails, and our sales team will also reach out to a high number of attorneys directly in order to find the best possible provider. So with that being said, if this presentation has resonated with you and you feel like you align with this business model and the principles we have shared, and you're in a position to take on some additional clients right now, you're going to want to take action immediately. And here's how you can do that. So you can contact us in one of two ways. 
You can either call us at the 800 number, 800-230-5984, or send an email to sales at unbundledattorney.com. So call or email. Or alternatively, you can visit our website, www.unbundledattorney.com. There you can click on contact us and complete a request. And then one of our dedicated representatives will reach out to you directly. And once you have had a chance to speak with our team, and both you and our team have decided that we're going to be a good fit to work together, if that's the case, the next step is we will go ahead and set up your account. And we do not require a sign-up fee. We never have. We never will. Then before we send you a single lead, we will schedule you an initial training where essentially what we'll do is we'll walk you through how to field the leads, reiterate some of the fundamentals, but also get into more of the detailed strategies, talk to you about what your strategy has been up till now on calling and interacting with new clients and you know give you feedback on how well or how well that may not work or will work with the leads we're going to be attracting and give you a very custom strategy for that. We'll also provide you with custom scripting, uh, templates for emails and text messages like we talked about before, and of course, answer any other questions you may have about the leads, about the services, anything else. We will also, at that time, connect you with our online community and our podcast and basically do everything we can to ensure that you are armed with the skills, the knowledge, the strategies, everything you need to convert your leads into paying clients from day one. Now, it is important to understand that once you start receiving leads, you're going to have access to a dedicated support representative. We have a a one-to-one relationship with each of our teams. So you're going to have their direct line and that support representative is committed to your success. And they will be following up with you every few leads to provide you with ongoing advice, customized guidance and feedback to ensure that you're continuing to experience exceptional results. And finally, if at any point, And for any reason at all, you decide you don't want to continue to receive more leads, you can cancel the service at any time. Uh, We do not require a long-term contract or commitment. We never have and we never will. And that is because we believe very strongly that this is about creating a win-win-win relationship. And what we mean by that is, number one, the client wins because, of course, they're able to get affordable legal assistance from an attorney that they can trust and is compassionate about serving their needs in an affordable manner. You win as the attorney because you're able to get a consistent and reliable source of new paying clients, which are going to help you make more money and grow your practice. And then as long as we are helping you accomplish these goals, you will happily continue with our service. And so we'll win as well. Now is the time to take action. If you would like to learn more about our lead generation services and see if we'd be a good fit to work together, go ahead and contact us right now at 800-230-5984 or send an email to sales at unbundledattorney.com and we'll get right back to you right away. Alternatively, you can also visit the website www.unbundledattorney.com and click on contact us and complete the request. Either way, we would like to thank you so much for taking the time today to learn more about how to build a thriving practice using internet leads and unbundled legal services. We certainly hope this presentation has been of great value to you and we'd love to hear your feedback. So with that, thanks so much, and we look forward to speaking with you soon. Bye for now.